What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Susie. Okay, as promised, I am going to show you how to get the bad ending on the daughter's tape. Now roll the extra long loading scene. I just want to say thank you so much for all the support on the stream that we did today and also on all the other Resident Evil videos. You guys have made like the start of 2017 like crazy successful for the channel, so thank you so much. Rainstorm at the Baker Farm. Three years ago, the Bakers were like any other family. They had just finished a family dinner, listening to the raindrops hammering against the window panes as they ate. A moment of peace and quiet, their last for some time. Yeah, it's um, after playing Resident Evil 7 and especially having that one scene with Jack towards the end of the game where he talks about how like he never wanted any of this to happen and that they were just kind of caught up with everything that was going on. They were like the family that was just accidentally caught in the crossfire. I feel like I had so much more like respect for Jack after that and just, I don't know, it makes me absolutely resent Evelyn and I know it's not her fault necessarily because she was created, but yeah, I don't like her very much. I really don't like her. <laughs> In today's top news, record-breaking rainfall from this week's hurricane looking to come to a close tomorrow morning as the storm moves on. Out in the Gulf, reports of a missing ship have rescue crews combing the coast. We'll have the details on that search shortly. But first, record rain over the past few days has left many residents in some of the parishes knee-deep in floodwaters. On radar, we can see the system moving along to the northeast, losing strength as it goes. And by tomorrow morning, we should be home Any free. news on the damage from the, the storm? Here in they haven't said. There's a big scratch on that TV that I've just noticed. Oh, oh she's so young. Yeah, how's our other guest? Sleeping, poor thing. Well, I say let him. He'll be okay here for a few days. At least was till we can get him into town. Zoe, go get some fresh clothes from the laundry room, okay? Oh, looks like there's some sort of oil yeah. spill or something. Yeah. Let's get this poor girl some fresh clothes and into a warm bed. Mm. We'll put her in Lucas's old room. Oh, come on, kid, you put her somewhere else? Oh, Lucas, you just hush. You've long outgrown that room. Always wanted to go to bed and breakfast. <laughs> you got your big break, didn't you? <laughs> get her to bed. <laughs> I'll put some soup on. I love Marguerite. You're good for soup, don't you think? Excuse me, Lucas. So let's just have a look at Lucas's phone real fast. One zero one nine. So remember that code because it is very important. I've put our guest to bed in the trailer. I told her she could have the old bedroom, but she insisted. All right, so let's go and get Evelyn. Change your clothes in the laundry room, dear. I know, I know. So you can come down here and get the lockpick. Now we don't need to be down there just now. We can come back there, of course. So you don't really need to do it, like, for this... Uh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me! Mom, I can't get past. I know, I'm going. So you want to go into the laundry room. The save room, as I like to call it, and get the change of clothes. So you don't need to go down that hole just yet, but we will have to go down there at some point. Let's just close that over. So let's go up the stairs and the first thing that I want to do, you don't have to do it if you're actually going for the bad ending, there's no need for us, in fact I'm not going to bother, there's no need for us to go into the attic because we don't need to know about Mia being outside in the trailer. Honey, please get her cleaned up and it's just a dry clothes. I need to check on the boathouse. It's half on the water last I looked. Yes, daddy. So what you would do is you would actually put an item in there. Now obviously I haven't picked it up because I don't intend to go into the attic. So let's go ahead and give Evelyn her clean clothes. All right, little girl, let's get you cleaned up. They're mine now. What? <laughs> Thank you. 
Thank you. So this is gonna be like the sad video. Let's just open that because we're gonna need to. There most certainly was a lightning strike, but I don't think that's what just happened. What was that? So let's go down the stairs and let's check on Lucas. Because Lucas has taken a nap on the floor. Why? Lucas? What happened? Are you okay? So obviously we can hear Marguerite talking upstairs and we should probably go and check on her and see exactly what is going on. Mama, is that you? Zoe, come look. Come see her gift. Look at all the pretties my little girl is giving me. Kiss me, lover. Get to the garage! Get some rope! Go! Now! I don't know what he needs the rope for, actually. It kind of creeps me out a little bit, because it's like... Is it going to tie her up or something? This takes ages to lift up. Trust me, it's like... Come on. I always expected that she was going to be sitting there or something. So let's get the rope. Let's get down and get up again. Gotta get down to get up. Gotta get down to get up. So I am recording this at 5 in the morning on Valentine's Day. I want to wish you guys a happy Valentine's Day. I hope you have fun whether you're single or in a relationship. Doesn't really matter, it's just another day. Glory. It's a whole lot worse than it looks. Cleanliness is next to godliness. And your mother's pretty fucking close to meeting him right now. She wants me to do this. I have to show her how to hold me together. She wants us all to show her our love. Daddy! You don't want to disappoint her now, do you? We can't do that. What are you talking about? Your new sister, Eve. <laughs> When I ask for rope, I expect to get rope. I'm gonna just go out and kill you and let me. Daddy! No, please don't. God into you! While you're under my roof, you'll do as I say you do. Okay, so you want to rope that so he doesn't get in. Get this fork and get the heck out of this room. Like, ASAP. Because he will come in and he will kill you. And to be fair, you'll get a pretty cool death scene, but that's besides the point. If you want to see the death scene, I would say check out my stream, but I do not intend to die. Alright. So if you want to go for the good ending, you want to go through there and pick up the head that's in the toolbox, which is right there. But obviously we're not doing that, we're going for the bad ending. So we're going to ignore that. So it's actually not possible to go into that room. I did try, but it's not possible. All right, so we need to get Marguerite to get away from the door. Where is she? It's really sad because she's kind of struggling a little bit. Like she's half like fighting what's going on with her. Right, so she can come up the stairs. I will go down the other stairs and we'll make it to the door. We're just gonna leg it. Make sure you keep your lighter off here though. Oh, what? Right, come here then. Hey. She's pretty slow. I say that, she's probably gonna catch me now. You better fucking not. I'm so sorry. I, I, I don't know what's wrong. Stay away. 
Don't touch her! Don't hurt my family! I don't understand, Mama, what's going on? Here! Take it! Take it! No! Go! Well, you don't have to tell me twice. I am out of here. I'll go get help. Okay, so again... Jack will be to your left. And you really want to get down here like as soon as you can. That's so creepy. You always did like hide in there. Like, no. I feel so bad for Zoe. Like, if I watched this happen to my family, I'd be devastated. And she seems like such a daddy's little girl. Right, I'm gonna try and do this. With no guarantee. You ain't smart enough to hide from me. Basically need him to there we go. Well now, there you are. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Open you piece of shit. Come on. Come on. Got it. Come on. Come on. What? Just up and leave us. Don't you want to meet your little sister? Now you'll just be in road. Now, not. So this is just one resolution. One way Zoe's struggle might have ended. Sometimes even just a small wandering step can change your course altogether. So you failed to lead Zoe on the true path. Now that was the first ending that I got, which of course is the negative ending. You don't really want that. And it, I don't know, it always makes you feel a little bit uncomfortable seeing Jack um, beating his daughter to a pulp. Not very nice at all. But yeah, that is the bad ending for the daughter's videotape. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!